But a lot of these girls, man, they just, like, I've been hot. You know, I've been a dude getting money. So before all these new new get money, everybody getting money nowadays. I don't know what y'all doing, but y'all doing it, keep doing it. <laughs> but before y'all was getting money, I was driving nice cars. We talking eight years ago when I was in the streets. So I was the dude that came to pick a nigga chick up that was hot. All the little hot Instagram celebrities and all that shit. I done ran through all of them. You know what I'm saying? I done, come on, they know. You know, you know. I don't. I ain't gonna name drop. I might name drop a couple, but right now we don't keep it at a minimum. You know what I'm saying? But I don't know. I just been hot. Girls DM me all day. They want to be on my my OnlyFans, but for OnlyFans, they always want to be around me because they see see they don't know if it's flexing. It's really not. So when they see the flexing, they want to be nosy and see if this shit is legit. And then when they see it's legit, I'm <laughs> and I'm guts. <laughs> Alright, so um, I mean let's get to it, man. OnlyFans king. You know what I mean? You got females all over OnlyFans making the bread. You got haters talking shit about guys creating OnlyFans making revenue. But it looks like Jimmy Smacks has mastered the OnlyFans concept. Facts. Let's let's talk about this though, because let's start from the beginning though. You were sitting there, you had to have been smoking the hookah, <laughs> chilling with, the vibes was just hookah perfect, vibes. you know what I mean? And you just said, yo, let me create an OnlyFans. Let's run, run through this real quick. How did this come to your mind to, to create this whole situation? Well, one day, I invited a chick over. You know, it was late night, like six in the morning, I was drunk. And she already had an OnlyFans. So when she came over and I smashed or whatever, she like, yo, let's record this for my OnlyFans. I'm like, I'm not getting on OnlyFans. What the fuck I'm getting on? What I look like? A nigga from the streets getting on a fucking OnlyFans and smashing you and showing my face. This is like porn. She like, no, no, no. Let's let's just do it. Let's do a video. So I'm like, all right, we're going to do it. I smashed. I saw her don't show my face or whatever. We did what we did. I love her little videos. I woke up the next morning and she made like 7,500. I'm like, hold on, hold on. I need half of that, because ain't no way you about to get paid on my, if you know what I mean. So she was just like, no, 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 I got you, I got you. She paid me 3500 I said, I made a 3500 overnight, just smashing you. And mind you, she's, she's not that lit. She, nobody really know her. So I'm like, yo, what if I do this shit? She's like, you should. If you do this, I'm going to show you what to do. So she showed me a little ropes. You know, shout out to Mulan Vuitton and um, K Parker. Them is the ones that put me on. Mulan Vuitton TV, I know her, and I definitely gotta salute you because she showed me how to use the shit, but we ended up smashing on my balcony. From my balcony, went into my room, my shower, everything, it went crazy. I said, let me post this on social media, and I'm gonna make OnlyFans. I posted it, and it went viral. I made like $10,000 on my first day. I couldn't believe it. I said, you know what? I'm about to make this a, my hustle, a full-time hustle. <laughs> over after that, game over, crunch time. I already got videos, and, it, and the funny thing is, I got videos from back in the days with popular girls and shit. I'm like, I start hitting them up, like, yo, can I can I post you? I, I pay you, whatever. I paid another girl. If you follow my OnlyFans, you know who I'm talking about. She's real famous. I posed her. We made 25 grand the first two days. When we made that type of money, I gave her half. I, I give her half, like, yo, thank you for letting me post it. Mind you, the video was in 2016, when I first came to Miami. I made 25 grand off a video from four years ago. God. Unbelievable. Hey man, I'm feeding the OnlyFans tomorrow. <laughs> Fuck that. Listen, man, I got your support. I'm supporting you, bro. Where they at? <laughs> Shit. Shit me. <laughs> Shit me, dog. So, so this literally just literally fell in your lap. It just fell in my lap, and I was just like, I'm just gonna take take advantage, you know what I'm saying? And I, I'm watching the feedback. I'm watching the celebrities that write me. I'm watching this. I'm they just like, yo, you got a lot of heart. You're just going to go on social media. You're already popular on social media, but I'm not gay. I'm not this. I'm not that. I support the LGBT community, but I don't do that. So they're like, yo, what the fuck? Like, this nigga just on social media just smashing a girl butt-ass naked, and he don't care watch because he got it free? Yeah, because that's the money's coming in. It don't even matter. I don't care what y'all think because at, at the end of the day, I like my money legit. So if I want to be rich and I'm from the streets, I got to figure out a, a, a way to do this shit. I gotta figure out a way to put it together where I ain't gotta sell drugs or sell sell this or do this or do this or go robbing people. I have to figure out a way to 
continue to stay rich because I was already getting money from the internet marketing from back in the days, trading Forex and binaries and all that crazy shit. But I had to find out the way to stay rich. I need to stay rich. That's the goal. You know what I'm saying? Anybody could be rich and lose it. You ain't rich. When you stay rich, you that nigga. Shit me. Definitely, definitely. So, I mean, let's talk about what? You said $7,500, $3,500 to 100 plus in 10 days. I literally only had my OnlyFans for one month and 10 days. Literally. And I made $106,000 in one month and 10 days. That's 40 days. I got 38,000 sitting I could cash out right now. Another 13,000 I could easily cash out right now. You know what? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cash out the whole thing. Boom, straight to my bank account. Still got another 13,000 pending in 40 days, no cap. Shitting me? I don't care what y'all say about me having the OnlyFans. I'm good. <laughs> this is an easy million dollars in six months, easy. That was $100,000 in a month. Oh. So I'm on my second month on OnlyFans, and I made almost $200,000. So I'm on a race to $100,000 a month. I made a hundred and what, probably $20,000 my first month, because you know the hype. But I'm still on a race to, it's about to be two months, uh, $100,000 every month. So that's my goal, is $100,000 every month, minimum. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? The, Big I grow, the fast they grow. You know what I'm saying? And I'm the hottest one on OnlyFans. From the CEO of OnlyFans, emailing me with the most subscribers in OnlyFans history. Because I'm smart. I made it free. And I made all y'all come eat it up, eat it up, eat it up. Give me all y'all money. Because guess what? Y'all going to get what y'all pay for. Straight up. Bro, who would ever think a, a dude from Harlem would be the number one person on OnlyFans when you got porn stars who've been in the game forever? Right, right. You know what I mean? Speaking of porn stars, bro, I done seen you with Cakey. All type of, like, come on, man. Talk about this shit. Like, first of all, I want to know, how does the situation go with these females? Is they just all in your DM? Is they lined up? Or is it like, you know, you got to do a little bit of work. You know what I mean? You get to shake up and dust yourself off. <laughs> you know, it's crazy. Um, but a lot of these girls, man, they just, like, I've been hot. You know, I've been a dude getting money, so... Before all these new new get money, everybody getting money nowadays. I don't know what y'all doing, but y'all doing it, keep doing it. <laughs> but before y'all was getting money, I was driving nice cars. We talking eight years ago when I was in the streets. So I was the dude that came to pick a nigga chick up that was hot. All the little hot Instagram celebrities and all that shit. I done ran through all of them. You know what I'm saying? I done, come on, they know. You know, you know. I, don't, I ain't gonna name drop. I might name drop a couple, but right now we gonna keep it at a minimum. You know what I'm saying? But... I don't know. I just been hot. Girls DM me all day. They want to be on my my OnlyFans, but for OnlyFans, they always want to be around because they see, see, they don't know if it's flexing. It's really not. So when they see the flexing, they want to be nosy and see if this shit is legit. And then when they see it's legit, I'm <laughs> and I'm guts and I'm guts. So all y'all dudes that keep thinking this shit fake is real. If you think this shit real, yeah, I might have gave her a bag. I might have got her a bag, $10,000, $15,000. But I made that back real quick because I don't stress over money. I'm a hustler. I'm a hustler. That shit get it back. So that new bag you see your girl rocking, I got it. And I got them pants and I got videos. You shit me. <laughs> on the OnlyFans soon. <laughs> yo. Yo. No cap, though. No cap. For those that know me in real life, not this internet stuff. If you know me in real life... You know the vibes, man.